Hello, good day and welcome. Today we'll be dealing with the University of Abuja Physics Post-TME Pass Question, Question 22. It says sound waves cannot be A. Refracted B. Reflected C. Made to produce an interference D. Polarized and E. Diffracted Now this question is actually telling us to list the property that is not a property of sound. Now first we have refraction now refraction is simply the ability of a wave to change direction due to the change of medium now if a wave is traveling from a dense to a lesser or to a less denser medium it changes direction and that's refraction changes speed the speed of the wave changes due to the fact that it has traveled from a dense medium to a less dense medium or from a less dense medium to a denser medium now that change in direction or speed of the wave refers to as what the refraction now sound waves can actually be refracted they can actually change their intensity when they are traveling from two different mediums now we have reflection. Now reflection is simply the bouncing back of waves. Now you notice that when you are in, a, in, in an enclosed room, a very big hall that is empty, and you shout, you notice that what? You begin to hear echoes of your voice like a replay of what you said now this replay or echo is due to the reflection of sound so sound waves can actually be reflected now see we have made to produce an interference now interference is simply the attributes of a wave to combine or made to coincide now the coincision of waves can actually be called interference you notice that when two or more people are shouting the resultant sound becomes higher the intensity of the sound becomes higher than when it is just one person so interference is actually a property that can be exhibited by a sound wave now d option d says polarized now from the word polarization now polarization is actually a property that is peculiar to transverse waves it's peculiar to transverse waves and now this is the ability of a wave to move in one plane and when a plane is made to move in a single plane it is said to be polarized now that's like i said it is a property that is exhibited by only transverse waves now sound is not a transverse wave it's a mechanical wave called longitudinal it's a longitudinal wave so only transverse waves can be polarized and like i said sound is a longitudinal wave so it cannot be polarized now most of the electromagnetic waves we know are what transverse waves so they can actually be polarized e diffracted diffracted now diffracted refers to the bending of waves around obstacles now the bending of waves around obstacles is what diffraction of that wave now you notice that what all the movement of waves through an aperture or a small opening now you notice that what you can be in a particular room and then you call somebody the person hears you from another room now this is due to the fact that the wave of sound travels around the openings or corners in the room now if it is actually an a very enclosed room without any opening when you talk people outside will not hear you because the sound wave will be restricted but now when there is a small opening 
the sound what it bends over and passes through this opening now from this explanation you agree with me that sound waves can actually be diffracted so i said sound waves can be refracted reflected they can be made to produce an interference and they can be diffracted but polarization is out of it sound waves cannot be polarized and that's option d because they are longitudinal waves now the answer to this particular question is option d thank you and god bless you please ensure you subscribe to our channel for more